here's the instructions um, on how to cast your cast net. This came with my six foot radius cast net here. Um, it's a pretty nice little cast net. It casts decently well. I just took it outside and cast it a couple times um, using this method. Um, it's an okay method. There's better methods for sure. Um, I like the method. I looked it up while here on YouTube. Um, you divide like one third of the line or one third of the net and punch your hand through it. Not like punch your hand all the way through it, but put your hand through it and then um, cast it that way. That way is a lot more efficient, but this way is okay if you're just starting out. But here's the first instruction put your hand through the hand loop, tighten the loop. Um, Okay, step three. Grip about 12 inches from top of net. This is for a six foot cast net. Um, grip about 12 inches. If you want it to um, cast easier, grip a little like maybe 16 inches instead of 12. Um, and up next here, hold net as shown in the picture. Um, hold it spread open. This way is okay. I, once again, it's not the easiest, but it works. Then next, turn your body slightly to the right without stopping. Pivot your left hand. Release the net in front of you. Best results, throw a slightly upward angle. If you're left-handed, use your left hand instead of right hand and continue to follow instructions using the left hand. Um, when your net lands in the water, let it sink to where you think the bait is, um, or until it reaches the bottom. Pull the drawstring, and the net will close, securing your bait. Lift net on the boat, and hold net as shown. Hold, well, hold top of the net as shown. An empty bait in the side gallon bucket, half full of water. Um, always hang your net after you use. Don't leave it in direct sunlight. Leave a weight line around latch of top net, allowing net weights to straighten net. Inspect net before you use. Use monofilament to repair any cuts or tears. And that's pretty much it with your net maintenance and uh, casting instruction. For that other um way to cast off it a link up for it. It's a, it's a whole lot better than this. I mean this is okay but the other way is better. Um yep, so and now I will um progress to the review of this six foot Cast net by forgot the company name. Here it is. Um, Marine Metal Products. I haven't really heard anything about this brand. It's Walmart brand. Um, I think it's a branch of Fray Bill. But anyway, here we got. 3 8 inch cast net with this is a real nice feature. Um, well, so these are what where I've been outside casting, um, and it's raining outside, unfortunately. But this is lead coated in plastic, so if your lead don't get beat up. That's a real nice feature. Um, on some other nets, it's just nothing but lead. But this has um, one pound of lead for each radius foot, which would make this a six pound cast net. It's a pretty hefty net. Um, I don't know 
if you can see that, but it, it makes a good thud when it hits the floor. But basically how a cast net works, you cast it when you think you got your bait. Um, you pull here on this black cord here in the floor. And it closes here at the bottom. Um, closes up your bait. And then you drag your bait up onto the shore. You will just pull the top here. Comes all the way back. Um, put it into the bucket or we'll put it out on the dock or whatever. And shake it real good. And then I'll drop your bait out. So. Um, that's pretty much it on this here cast net. Nice, simple cast net. Comes with a storage box. Pretty cool little storage box. I'm here, I think, this is the largest barrel swivel I've ever seen. It's huge. Um, but, I think that's it. That's it. But, by the way, here we are.